Giraffes at the Arusha National Park. We have four giraffes here, family. Close up. What is wrong with you guys? These are teenagers. They're teenagers? Yeah. They're teenagers. What are they called? The group of, uh, of, when they are standing still, we call them Towers of Giraffe, and when they are moving, we call Journey of Giraffe. You see, I'm a Gumazuni. Oh my, this is so fresh. So they're teenagers. These are young ones. Young ones. Wait yeah, from the right The next one is. They the want to, they're not the baby. Go into the mall. Look of how it's spreading its legs to drink. It's getting, reaching down to drink. Uh -huh. uh, but the water is deep, far deep. Too deep. Wow. Yeah. So, so Mali, um, I guess they're kind of making sure that you know, hippos drag them in the water, right? <laughs> so they're kind of backing up? Not, Is that what it is? Not hippos. Alligators and crocodiles. Oh. Uh, Flocks. For here, they do not really scared of alligators or crocodiles they're because they're shoes? not here. But they have to watch out. When they put their head down to drink, most of the time is when they've been hunted by lions since they have no, no ability to see. Mm -hmm. they, 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 they can't outrun lions. Can, they, can. they can. They can. They can. They can kick a lion. Yeah, no, they, 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 they can kick a lion. They can stomp. Not, them not good in the start, but as they run, they can outrun. They, they, they can. If you get, if they get a start, well, I have to add all this. And can't they just kick them? Really? Yeah, lion with the with the kick. Yes, they have a very strong kick. Yeah, that's what I thought. A very strong kick. The giraffe has to be careful of getting down into the water because when they drink they cannot see far and also they go down for like maximum of two minutes since they doesn't have a good system that controls blood to reach the brain so otherwise if the, if the, the giraffe stays long the blood will flow to the brain and damage the brain that's why when they are sleeping, they always keep their necks erect, mm -hmm. heads up. And the longest giraffe can sleep that has been recorded is mostly up to 20 minutes. Dang. What? That's yeah. it? Yeah. Now over so here, they awake all the time? They are mostly awake. They are is mostly it? active, moving day and night. Okay. They, so are, they, they are day and night. They have night and so day So I catch you sleeping and give me a giraffe Some of the animals are only nocturnal. And some of the animals are only, you know, like cheetah cannot move during the night because they don't have night vision. So you see that one is drinking? Yeah. Look at that. Yeah. Oh, yeah. spread his legs? Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. We'll try again, maybe. Now, do they? Do the female lions, they're the ones that do the hunting. <laughs> yes. Female, yeah. female lions. <laughs> the male can also hunt. <laughs> but if you're talking in terms of success, Females are more successful. You know the thing is, the male has got a strong canine teeth that he can help to open the kill. Sometimes the female can kill a buffalo and she is not that good opening the tough skin. So she will call or bring the male to open the kill, but mostly the male will start eating. And when he is eating, he will not let others to come in. Nope. Right. That's why we say the lion, male lion first, then cubs, and then female. Yeah. In our in our in our culture, that's how how it used to be. Today is facing out, but it used to be like that. Uh, first, and the first, and the first, and the children and women eat yes. last. Yeah. And, and sometimes, and everybody eats so, the sometimes the women miss the meal and they have to cook again mm -hmm. in my tribe mm -hmm. where when the when the men are eating women um wife of the family she will be an angle in an angle that she can see the men eating because she doesn't want her husband and friends to call for a food so she's looking from a certain point that you don't see her and when the food gets like almost to over it's on the plate is almost empty mm -hmm. she will always bring food whether you want or you don't, she will bring and you may say, no, we are satisfied, and then she will go. Next is children. The children will eat. When they are satisfied, then the mother will eat. And you know, we have, we, we have this culture of multiple wives. So somebody will have two wives, three. And the, one of the three wives will be watching the men eating. And all the children will come together and eat. And after that, 
the three wives will sit together and eat. Do you know the uh, black women from America? <laughs> no, I'm talking of my culture. <laughs> I, oh my God, what's the man's responsibility Karen, to I still, I still have one. Good for you. Mm -hmm. After the black woman, what's the man's responsibility? He has to make all the money he can eat. Sorry? I said, what's the man's responsibility, responsibility when he has it. multiple wives? Nothing. He has no responsibility. No, he does. He's got uh, there, is a, there is a division of responsibility. There are things that the woman cannot do, and there are things that the man cannot do. In my culture, I cannot enter the kitchen, I cannot cook. Why? So she cooked for me, I look for food, I look for income, she is home. So it's, it's in my culture, I'm not saying that you can follow that. No, I really appreciate you sharing that. And do you know that, and do you know that, and you know that sometimes, sometimes somebody having two, three wives is not his desire. It can come from the first wife. Yes, she does the choosing. She can may have a very good girlfriend that she doesn't want to lose. Right. She will bring her and become a second right. wife right. and it can go to be the third right. wife. And sometimes for some reason she cannot conceive, then she will marry a woman to be your second wife. That's what I'm talking about. But then the children the of the second wife belongs to the first wife because she is the one who married that woman. So this what? thing this this the this system of second wife? first you wife can marry the second wife. She two women are married. married as in the ceremony. Yeah, but it's not like I don't as okay. in like a. It's not like what is happening today. Yeah. 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 Right. That's not to do with right. like, okay. yes, nothing to do with homosexual. Ceremony. Thank you, appreciate it, brother. Appreciate you. It's about yes, yes. Like, it's, a, it's, a Somali, it's about nation building, right? Oh, Community. Oh, no, what she what she will do? She will find <laughs> another woman. She will be the ceremony. Yeah, I've seen it already. That's a Okay. My grandfather, father of my father of my my mother, he had two wives. But the second wife came okay. to his first wife. Char washer charging unit. He will always switch it off when the engine is not running, eh? What, what's your tribe? Here, uh, okay. you say in your tribe, you are they practice a multiple of bigamy? Yes. Is it religious or uh, cultural? It's cultural. It's cultural. It's cultural. Yeah. Yeah, but I have a friend from Ghana. I, I, can I ask and you this? I'm sorry. Have you, have you seen the women with uh, children without husband? Where? Somewhere in the world. Uh, are they having what? Babies from... Uh, Single men, or they also get babies from a married man. So multiple wife, multiple wives is something that's going on, but in a black hole that you don't see. People say I have one wife, but somewhere he's got another woman. And then you say, oh, I have only one wife. I love my wife. Be honest, marry another woman, live with both of your wives. It has been, even during the Bible time, it has been like that. I appreciate it. Hey, hey, Mali, I appreciate your recommendation. I'm going to follow it's just that. Um, Mali, Don't do what I think. A lot of times, it's single men with Don't. multiple women. Ooh. Kids are all over the place. Yeah. So, the and nobody's been right around Nobody's been That's not nation. That's not nation. I feel there. No, it depends on what culture you are in. We have the tribe in uh, the, the Warthog. We have a tribe in uh, along the Lake Victoria. It's like having two wives is must. Because people, what the people would think of you having one wife? Oh, there's warthogs here. I love that. They used to have the show. But they would, they keep on running. So, yes, family, lots of conversation on nature and nation building. It's a carcass. You see the bones of a yeah, buffalo. Yeah, That's the buffalo yeah. carcass. Yeah. Uh, oh, so that was a kill. That was a kill. Yeah. That means the alliance. You see the, the those bones. Oh, yeah. That means the alliance killed. 
Uh, the biggest, yeah, if it's a pack of hyenas, more than more than six, yes, they can kill a buffalo. But I think that was a lion kill. Those hyenas are you know the thing is, when the lion met, um, when the lion hunts a buffalo, he cannot eat everything. He will only eat flesh, intestine, and then we leave the rest there. And then the second hyenas or jackals will come in, eat what they can eat. And mostly the hyenas are the ones who can eat even the skin. And then the bones are exposed. The cleaners of the bones are the vultures. The vultures will come and clean the bones and leave the bones white naked. And after that, microorganism will recycle the bones. After recycling them, they get into the grass. The grass gives to the vultures. Grass eaters. 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 Gr